Hi everyone, this is the math 30-1 uh, functions review and this is multiple choice number four. Okay, the question says the graph of the function, and then they give you f of x is equal to x plus 4x minus 2, x plus 6, is transformed by a factor of 2. Okay, well they're a little vague about what that means. Okay, we know that we're multiplying by 2, but the thing is we don't know whether this is a horizontal stretch or a vertical stretch. So which of the following can be true here? Well, we're going to be given information here about the zeros and the y-intercepts. So the thing to do here is to go back to the original and see if we can identify the zeros and the y-intercepts that we start off with. So our zeros, the roots, are really, really easy to come up with. Okay, We just have to look at the different factors here. So if a factor is x plus 4, we know that we've got negative 4 as a root. Okay, x minus 2 means we've got 2 as a root. And x plus 6 means we've got negative 6 as a root. Okay, so those are our x-intercepts. And then if we want to find the y-intercept, okay, we're just going to let x equal 0. This is going to be 0 plus 4, 0 minus 2, 0 plus 6. So 4 times negative 2 would be negative 8, times 6 is going to be negative 48. Okay, so those are the original roots and y-intercept. Now, let's go over here. The new statement, uh, the new zeros of the function will be negative 12, negative 8, and 4. Well, okay, well that is multiplying that by 2. So quite honestly, it looks like the answer is this one. But let's just keep looking here. The new zeros, well, okay, well no, this would be multiplying the, the roots by a half. So that's not it. Okay, now don't get caught up in that f flipping it by, you know, flipping the, the stretch factor and reciprocating and whatnot, blah, blah, blah. When the, when the statement is made here, it is transformed by a factor of 2. What we're saying there is what's going on on the graph. We are saying that you are multiplying the graphical features by 2. And in this case, it's the, the roots, it looks like. Um, the new y-intercept is 96. Now, 48 times 2 is 96, but not negative 48. So although that's close, that's not it. And again, uh, to get negative 24, would be multiplying by a half, not 2. So the answer is A.